Hello guys, the chairman here again and welcome to this new series called FM Simulates and the basic idea for this um, series is that I'm gonna simulate one season forward each big uh, premier division in the game uh, meaning uh, England, Italy, Spain, France, Germany uh, you, and if you want to see some smaller leagues also I could do that but at the start those big leagues and simulate one season forward let, and we see who will win the uh, league uh, who's the best goal scorer and uh, stuff like that how will the champions league go and stuff like that so uh, at the start if you are liking hit that like button and if you are new in my channel please subscribe it will help my channel to grow and uh, therefore more people will find those videos and yeah stuff like that but now we gonna start this episode um, the first episode is for Barclays Premier League and let's simulate the season forward and let's see how the Premier League will go and welcome back and uh, let's see uh, first piece of, piece of news is that Ips which is promoted to the Premier League three days ago also Scandrop is pre uh, promoted um, what's uh, sports mode Manchester City's Pellegrini sets retirement date um, Emery set for Manchester United job after interview and question mark a uh, lot group set to take Southampton for interview Whelan uh, set sides of retirement and stuff like that available job a um, lot of conference jobs one uh, league two and a couple of league one jobs and the Premier League Southampton Stoke and Manchester United are <coughs> without a manager so Let's go and see the Premier League and ah controversially Chelsea have won the league by nine points. And Manchester City were second, Arsenal third place, Liverpool fourth place. So those four are going to Champions League next season. Tottenham fifth, Man United sixth, West Brom surprisingly seventh place. <laughs> Swansea at 8, Everton 9th, uh, and therefore at the bottom Southampton 18th, Leicester 19th, and Sunderland 20th position. And uh, those three teams are going down. And was it at the last day of the season? Yes, Southampton lose to Arsenal. And uh, did Bournemouth win? No, they lose also. So if Southampton would have won Arsenal in that game, they would have been uh, 17th, um, or actually they have been, haven't wouldn't would have been 16th and uh, uh, Bournemouth, Bournemouth 18th and Crystal Palace I think 17th. How did Palace? Yeah, they lose also the last game. Um, stats wisely, uh, more uh, goals. Uh, Juan Mata, surprisingly, 21 league goals were the best goal scorer uh, alongside Christian Eriksen. So, two central midfield attacking midfielder were the two best, uh, best uh, goal scorers. That is surprisingly odd. Uh, third place was Callum Wilson from Bournemouth, which uh, was 17. He got 20 league goals. Um, for those assists, there are two City players, Kevin De Bruyne, 18 assists, David Silva, 17. Uh, third place, James Morrison, West Brom, 14 assists. That is quite achievement also. But, uh, average rating, Sergio Aguero, over, nine, uh, over 8. Average rating, like they have uh, Mesut Özil and Juan Mata also. <laughs> Most player of the matches were uh, given to Charlie Daniels eight times. He had been best. Uh, also, Sergio Aguero and Juan Mata got eight 
player of the match. Uh, clean Siege, Joe Hart was the best goalkeeper for a uh, league. 12 uh, clean sheets, Thibaut Courtois got 10 clean sheets and David De Gea, Manchester United goalkeeper got 9 clean sheets. Clean sheet. Most yellow cards uh, got Andrew Ayew, he got 13 yellow cards. Uh, Yusuf Mulumbu uh, and uh, Simus Kolma got 11 each. And uh, <clears throat> also Sky Bad League, yes, uh, the playoff final Ipswich won Brentford on penalties, so Ipswich got promoted to, to the league. League and let's look at the table. Fulham won the championship. Bolton were second, and uh, uh, Hull, Blackburn, and Brentford uh, were other teams in those playoffs. And but Ipswich, which was uh, sixth place, got got that promotion, and those are the three teams to go up in the Premier League for next season. Jordan Rhodes. Uh, got 26 goals, Ross McCormack 24, Zach Law 20, and uh, you can see all the all other pieces of business here. Uh, if we go back to uh, Premier League uh, and managerial movement, let's look. The Brendan Rogers was Sunderland manager um, after, and actually I think he still is. Let's see. Yes, he is the Sunderland manager after, after Sam Allardyce got sacked, I think, because Sunderland is rock bottom. Mark Huge uh, left for Stoke and Ronald Coleman for Southampton Post. Louis Van Gaal, uh, <clears throat> will he step down in real life also after one season in charge for Manchester United? He stepped down uh, now and Sven Jöran Eriksson, new manager of Leicester City. Claudia Ranieri stepped down or get sacked. Oh, the final have been played. Manchester City is the champion of uh, Champions League. And they beat Juventus 2-1 in the final. Sergio Aguero was the best goal scorer, 10 goals in this competition. Karim Benzema got 9, Diego Costa also got 9, Kevin De Bruyne also, also here, he was really good, 7 assists, Lionel Messi got 6, and Luka Modric 5 assists. And the final have been played, Atletico won 1-0 against Galatasaray in final, um, Ener Valencia for, for West Ham got 14 goals, Dimitar Perpatov for Park also 14 goals, uh, Gonzalo Higuain uh, was third in 11 goals. Mark Noble got 10 assists. Uh, Lucas B Biglia got 8 and Dimit Dimitri Payet also got 8 assists. Uh, and uh, that's for that. Let's go back to the uh, Premier League and uh, perhaps we could look um, overview, season preview. Let's look big transfers. Which one was the biggest? Chelsea got two the biggest transfers uh, for this season. Uh, Jose Jimenez from Atletico to Chelsea, 40 million euros. Uh, he's that cracking central defender. And the other, another one was Hakan Kalhanoglu from Leverkusen to Chelsea, 33 million euros. So they spent uh, 73 million euros for two guys and yeah, that was f worth it. And if you look here, Mattia De Ziglio, 14 million, Zime Verziaiko, uh, 12.75 million and Lucas Prato also over 10 million. So they, they spent a lot of money. Let's look actually how much they spent. They spent 109 million for five guys and they only got again uh, 12.6 million euros. Uh, third biggest signing was Joao Mario's <coughs> transfer to Arsenal, 31.5 million euros. Which kind of player? Central midfielder, he looks really, really good. 
central midfield guy. And then there is Mark Bartra to Manchester United over 30 million also. Stefano Stuararo also to Arsenal from Juventus for 25 million. Daryl Janmaat uh, transfer to Newcastle to Manchester United 17.5 million. And you can see rest of the transfers here. I can scroll it a bit down so you can see. Transfers like Pepe, Real Madrid to Manchester United 3.9 million transfer and there is a lot of more of those. So that's wrap the first episode of this uh, Football Manager Simulate series. So hit that like button if you like what you did see and please comment in below how have you your seasons go if you have already have the time to play one and uh, what do you think this kind of save uh, and uh, if you are new in my channel please hit that subscription button it will help my channel to grow and stuff and st things like that but I'm the chairman and we see you next time goodbye